Hey everybody, Hi. welcome back to Soul Calibur 6. We're continuing with Kimiko's story. K Kimi, go ahead and read. Because it's all you. No, I don't wanna. F frick. Both greetings and farewells were to be found in da Daka, where Maxi's player waited us. I should have played all their character stories beforehand so you knew what these characters are like. Well, it's okay, it's fine, it's don't worry about it. Because you'd like them. Experience. Forgive me. Do you want to? Do you want to voice this guy, Kuro? Oh no, I'm okay. All I'm right. probably gonna check out after this. Oh, see, I'm just kidding. All right. Wow, rude. <laughs> rude. <laughs> it's funny to bully your friends. Okay, don't worry about That's it. That's true. It's no, yeah. Forgive me, but this is where I must take my leave. Where are you off to in such a rush? I've heard rumors of strange happenings in my hometown of Yangguang. My brother's still there. I'm worried for his safety. Aww. That's too bad. It's been short, but it was a whole lot of fun. Take care. Safe journey to you, too. Farewell. <clears throat> With a bright smile and a small brow, however on left. Kimiko slash. Kimiko. I have to report you to my employer. You go wait by my ship. Head to the docks. You can't miss it. I'll give you your cut of the board there. See ya. Aki. <laughs> Who are you? What do you want? Maxie says, wait for him here, tell anyone here. Uh, wait. Yeah. I was told to wait here. What's going on? Oh, you're gonna like these guys. <coughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Kim, this weirdo just turned up, says she got business with Maxie. That's so. Guess that means Maxie trusts her. <laughs> Looks that way. Captain likes you. You must be pretty tough. So how about you show us how tough? Oh, shit. I like, okay, I'm a kick I, like, ass. I like how they're like, treat it, do it, show us. I really think she has anything to prove. Let's see if she's if she's crew material, because they might fight, just add her to her crew. Their crew, honestly, can be totally real with you. Yeah. Look, look, look! They're standing there with the crossed arms. Kinda kicked his ass. Yeah. That's putting it lightly. <laughs> Time to do right. it again. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Shit. Shit. Oh, we're back. Ow. Owie. Ow. Jesus. <laughs> Don't be a hater. <laughs> Don't be a hater. <laughs> Don't worry, we're gonna get it. We're gonna. We have to get it. We have to. Oh, After that last time, there's no way you can't. Ow! Fuck you! <laughs> there you go. Yay! Jesus, give it to me. Don't be a hater! <laughs> Don't be a hater! Annihilate! <laughs> God! Love it. Damn, son. <laughs> Don't be a hater! It fucking destroys you! <laughs> <laughs> Love it. You did pretty good on that. Love it so much. <laughs> that was a fine show, matey. <clears throat> hey, I'm back! Where's the warm welcome for you, Captain? Welcome back, brother. You Aww. got us all worried. So what's the story with this land lover? <laughs> what are you calling a land lover, motherfucker? This crew is my savior. We gotta thank Kimiko here for making our employers happy. What I'd say about looking before you leap, Maxi. Remember what happened last time? How <laughs> quick your belly aching. It all worked out in the end, didn't it? <clears throat> Harsh words aside, Kim didn't really seem angry. He must be used to Maxi's flight so fancy by now. So you know my crew's my family. They look rough, but they're a good bunch. You said you were looking for a, a thing, an uh, astral fissure? Well, as a man of my word, I'll help you. There hey. you go again, leaping before you go looking. <sighs> so what is this astral fissure business anyways? I'll, I'll tell you once everyone's here. I need the whole crew on board for this. Here's your share of the bounty, by the way. I actually had to make a bag of gold coins. It's gonna take a while to get ready. 
So do what you gotta do in that time. Two coins. No, one and a half. J <laughs> this town's got a lot of shops and great places to eat. Why not check them out? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Hook up. Where is the dildo shop? <laughs> Weapons. Uh. Or not. What's our weapon? not really like. What is our weapon? Oh, our weapon's only oh, at 30. One. Everything else in that shop is better. Oh, and really? We have $7,000 to spend. Well, it has to be like a dual, dual sword thing, because that's. In in universe. Ooh, either one of those would work. I'm gonna try Geralt's weapons. Okay. Yeah, see the damage increase? Oh, what yeah. What the fuck are these? What the hell? Are those from, like, other playthroughs? Oh. Maybe. Maybe from other playthroughs. Huh. <laughs> oh, well, anyways. Yeah. The Merchant Guild in Daka was trying to repair Watergate, but progress was constantly being interrupted by bandits. They needed a guard. Who, who was I not to heed their request? The Bengali, what? The Bengalese. Bengalese city of Dhaka lives on the edge of a wide tract of wetlands. While the port is lively with track ships, childing the neighborhood tributary of the Great Ganges River. The development of a land route lags behind. Come on, Discord. Well, that was me. Sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> the land route is merely a wooden path that stretches across the marshy expanse that surrounds the city. Points where it must cross a corn flux of the many twisting streams and canals are hard to reach and poorly maintained, which limits traffic. First time on a wooden road? Be sure to watch your footing. Trips <laughs> <Yep>, immediately. <laughs> My client is a prominent merchant in Dhaka. The merchant guild he runs has hired me to guard over repair work on the road. The path ended abruptly at a large sandbar. It looked as though much of the bridge that should have been there had been washed away downstream. Damn. Didn't think the damage was this bad. Well, get to work, everyone. Ay! Ay! I'm sorry. <laughs> Keep a sharp eye out for, out for trouble. Everyone's scared of bandits around this area. Flooding caused by a broken water gate last month caused trade to grind to a halt. However, brigands robbed and drove away the workers sent to repair the problem, so little progress had been made. How does it look? Well, parts of the entire road were swept away, so we'll b need to bring in lumber. It'll be ten days at the earliest. Damn. I see. I was afraid that would be the case. Well, I have business in the city to attend to, so continue your work. Trouble came that night, and not long after the merchant left. You're in search of more easy pickings? It looked like the brigands had been imped impeding the repair work had shown up. I stood against them. It was my job, after all. You were in our way. Give them a chemical well, line. good. Fuck you. There you go. Time to beat her this! <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what Geralt's moveset is like with Kimiko. Now I'm curious, because I don't remember what Geralt's moveset really looks like. Well, your keys are okay. Ooh. Ow. Ow. One Ow. more fucking time. Hey. Oh shit. Damn! Damn, <laughs> okay, Kimmy, I see you. <laughs> oh. Ow. <laughs> Ow. Piece of that actual shit. Get the hey. fuck. <laughs> Ow. I'm not used to this, this style. That's why. Why are you kidding okay. me? <laughs> oh my god, we sent him flying. Right. Can I leave now? 
<laughs> Can I leave now? Ow, ow. Ow. Don't cry now. Don't cry now. What? <laughs> I think the, the other one was funnier. <laughs> don't, be, yeah. don't, don't be a hater. <clears throat> she has lots and lots of codes for different weapons, so we can, we can do a lot of stuff with her. Yeah, that's true. Fine, until we find the one that like fits. Or whatever. Ten days after I drove the brigands, the repairs were complete and the land route opened again. However, I had a feeling that the end of the story was yet to come. Come. Sorry. <laughs> Pervert. I, I don't even know why I did that one. Pervert. That's why. Shh. No. Fuck you. No. You know. Doc, I'd level up. Will that mean Weapon? we get better weapons? No. Hopefully. No. <laughs> um. <coughs> let's give it, her... Or? Something at least over 45, right? Sure. Oh. Ooh. This gives her a lance and a sure. short sword, but I imagine it would still work well. Yeah, as long as it's like two weapons and not just one. <coughs> it yeah. pretty much works. Like, dual pistols or whatever. Daka, a city of trade and commerce located a short distance up river from the harbor. It wasn't that well known yet among travelers, but it was starting to carve a name for itself as a key point on east-west trade routes. I wandered aimlessly through crowded streets where the hustle and bustle seemed to never cease. Visit the... Market. I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> as I explored the busy market, I picked out a woman's clear voice through the clamor. Hey, you ever heard of those rumors about demons in the village near here? The ones that started about a year ago, right? They frightened me something awful. I heard all the demons have been taken care of for good! I knew it was gonna slip into that. I fucking knew it. <laughs> I was like trying to figure out like what <laughs> would, what this would work for. Really? It's true! I bet we have the qualifiers to think for that! <laughs> That was like extremely loud, I'm sorry. Are you still obsessed with them? You need to get your priority straight. Come on, Slowpoke. Hey, wake up! <coughs> As it disappeared from view, I tried to recall where I'd heard from the qualifiers before, then it hit me. They were the ones who I fought by the Astral Fisher. There you are. Been looking for you. Captain's got something y'all want to hear. I followed Max's crew member back to the ship. <coughs> Yo, you heard of Young Wang? Port in Ming. Recently, no one's been able to get in and out of there. Out of the port there, I heard. Info came from a reliable source, say the place is covered in a red mist, and it might have had something to do with an epidemic or something. Been a lot of trouble with crime there, too. Horan said something strange is going down in Yang Wang. Judging by what we found, there's a good chance the natural fissures appeared there. Horan. He was probably heading straight for a maelstrom. Oh god, that's right! That me to the bone. Horan's going straight in that fucking direction! Oh shit, wait, you're right. We'll take you to Young One also, if you like. Give me one, I'll be up for one second. So I can turn the light on my room because it's getting right. dark. I gratefully accepted Maxie's offer. Also, Once your preparations were. So no, uh. -uh. We're complete. We were, we were to meet at the ship. The whole country's opened up to us now. Okay, I'm back. A good section of the <laughs> map not... has opened up. Your section in the map that's opened up. Capture the pepper thieves. <laughs> the west coast of the Indian subcontinent produced vast quantities of valuable black pepper, and one of its farm from farm owners had a request from me. So doing all these side missions gives us a lot more strength in leveling up. So I suggest we do them. Oh, okay. Thieves have been stealing from black pepper farm, and I accepted a request to apprehend them. 
I waited quietly in the field for a few hours before I heard s several sets of footsteps approaching. I had to start up the challenge and one suddenly attacked from behind! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Fuck him up, Kimiko. I think, this, I think we're using Hilde as a weapon type, which is cool. That's cool. Hilde is one of my favorite You're cool. characters. Your favorite character? <laughs> no. Is this Hilde's file? Yeah. Final oh yeah, it is. Ooh. Oh shit. Ow. Call me stupid. How dare you, motherfucker? I'll show you, stupid bitch. <laughs> God. That feels like a typical. <laughs> I'm not having come like pseudo. Voice. Well, she has my character, so like, of course I have to. Yep. Jesus! <laughs> Impales him and then fucking damn. <laughs> yeah, that feels like a chemical line, honestly. Don't cry now. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do the, the 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 final attack. It was it's a really cool one. Well, you're cute, so it's okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I delivered the thieves to the farm's owner. They were, in fact, laborers who had worked there. The owner was clearly pleased and gave me a generous amount of the expensive rice spice. Ooh. Nice. See, we're leveling up. Hell yeah. Oh my god, everything is opening up now. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Let's do another mission. Fortune's yeah, part of the old man and the map. While traveling through a port town, I saw an elderly man being threatened by a, a brute trying to make a map of a from. Oh, take a map from. I know how to read it from. Sort of... No! I was struggling along the harbor, gazing out at the peaceful sea when I heard quarreling coming from one of the piers. Old man, give me that map already. No, fuck you. You shouldn't be so eager for death! Shut up already, unless you want me to take that map off your corpse! I searched for the source of the shouting and saw a large burly man threatening an elderly gentleman. It seemed that the burly man had noticed me and he turned to glare in my direction. Who are you? You looking for the treasure too, huh? No, please, young one, move along. You shouldn't even get involved with this man or me. The elderly gentleman seemed surprisingly calm, but I couldn't let this ruffian threaten a defenseless old man. I readied my weapon. Yeah, let's beat this motherfucker up. Yep. Is it just gonna be one round or two rounds or three even? Let's see how strong this guy is. Yeah. Two rounds. Ah, oh, okay. He is so unserious. What was that scream that he did when he kicked his ass? Like, <laughs> like great. <laughs> Stupid. Ow. Uh, you know what? We need to have a talk now. Yep. Mister. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> What if I just kick him? <laughs> just kicks him in the face. <laughs> I fucking missed! Rude! How dare you cancel our fucking combo, you bitch! Fuck you! Ow, ow, ow. Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> That's it. No, we have to kill him. We he have to kill him now. Yep. 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 <laughs> that was like fucking rude, honestly. <laughs> oh shit! Jesus! <laughs> we have to kill the shit out of him now. Yep. <laughs> Fine, whatever. That's... If he attacks me one more time, stop. Ray. There you go, fucking dickhead. Piece of fucking dog shit. For real. <sighs> D 
damn you, I'll remember this, you hear me, you'll get what's coming to you. Pussy. The man <laughs> fled into town, cursing me as he went. Thank you, young one. I tend to get harassed by scoundrels like him quite often, because... Well, you aren't just in that. Normally I let them scream and shout and turn the tables on them when they grow violent. I asked all men why people were after him. A long time ago, my friends and I braved an ancient ruin in search of fabulous treasures. The price I paid for my foolish courage was my leg and the lives of all of my friends. The curse of the horrible yeah. place took them all. <laughs> Even though I escaped with my life, the curse holds me still. Often greedy fools come to me and demand the map in hopes they can claim ruin's riches. A pained grimace on the man's face spoke of the horrors he had seen. I know okay. better than anyone to tell the terrible fate that awaits all who go into that accursed place. I would not wish it upon anyone. Even men like the one you just chased off. However... The old man studied me thoughtfully. Exhaustion and pain rushed into the lines of his face, but a fierce resolve burned in the depths of his eyes. It is time. Oh shit. Go over to an old raggedy parchment. He held it out, offering it to me. Take it. We'd only just met. But my adventurer's instincts telling me that you're the one destined to have it. Oh, of course, shit. I can't guarantee you survive. Or even if the tales of the treasure are too. However, I'm tired. So very tired. I want to see this in the hands of one strong enough to bear it. And forget everything that happened. Aww. With that, the old man turned and slowly staggered off toward the, the end of the pier. A cursed ruin and hidden treasure? <laughs> It all sounded so impossible. Still, something told me that if I must pursue this mystery, whatever it, must, whatever it led me. There's this one wind lady story that you really like that we're definitely going to do. Ooh. Okay. And it's it's really sweet. Boy. Boy, you. You're boy, you. No. Uh -uh. <laughs> Explore surrounding area. No. There we go. Fortune's burden, the ruins. Oh, we're doing the ru <laughs> Oh shit. I had found the hidden ruins in the forest and I was about to discover the truth behind the the curse that had terrified the elder man, so. Okay. Change weapons again. I need something that I know I'll be able to use better. Ah, okay. Fuck it, we're gonna have to go with 2B style. Because these okay. guys are gonna be- these guys are dangerous. They're level 12, we're level 8. Oh shit. The, the map that the old man had entrusted to me pointed to us, the forest deep inside of which were the cursed ruins where treasure hid. By the time I arrived at the forest's edge, though, the day had already gone dark. As soon as I entered the forest, I felt like I was being watched. The feeling only grew as I followed the map toward the ruins. Suddenly, my watches revealed themselves. I held my lantern up and countless skeletons came into view, shuffling their way towards me through the trees. Some of them looked ancient, while others seemed quite fresh. I sense a familiar of evil emanating from the, sh the shambling corpses. This must be the curse that old man had mentioned. With every moment that passed, more skeletons gathered around me. I needed to destroy them before I was completely surrounded. Oh boy. Shit. Oh. <clears throat> it's time to go sicko mode. <laughs> Fuck it. Yeah? Kimiko, it's time to wreck some shit. Yep. Ow! Ow! That's a lot of health. Jesus. That is a lot of fucking oh health being taken out. That's a lot of damage. That is a lot of, lot, 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 lot of damage. Yep, I can't let him take- Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Come on, Kimiko! You can take it! Kimiko's <laughs> Holy shit! Okay. I don't think our heart, our health regens. I don't think it regens. Oh it god! Regens. Oh fuck! Please regen! Please regen! Please regen! Please regen! Oh thank god! Okay. Oh thank! Oh, a little bit. Okay. Okay. That should be enough. Hopefully. Kick his ass! Kick his ass! Go! You're not giving <laughs> any breathing <laughs> room. Do not breathe. Do not live. Just die. Oh god! <laughs> fuck! 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 Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Kick. Yes. Yes. Don't be a hater. Fuck you. We made the skeleton naked. Yep. <laughs>
Come Don't on, let Santa for pirates find out. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yep. Or just don't find out that you killed a skeleton warrior. Or that, yeah. Just in general. <gasps> Fuck. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Fuck. It's okay. You got this. You got this. You got this, I believe. Fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I think we did it. Please. Yes. Don't be a hater. Don't be a hater. <laughs> oh god. No, keep it going. Holy I think shit. you did more than enough. <laughs> yep. <laughs> just yes. a little more. Just trying to murder the already murdered skeleton. <laughs> I know, right? I was having fun. I want to murder more. I want to murder more. He's oh. already dead. <laughs> no, what am I doing? Oh. Fuck you. Oh. I'm bloodthirsty. <laughs> God. <laughs> How long I finally couldn't save when the last skeleton felt the sky was already glowing with the light. Oh, from. so she fought through the entire fucking night. Got you. He's <laughs> yeah, that feels like something she would do, I mean, honestly. The skeleton genocide. That's I think not fun. realizing the ruins I saw were quite right by me. Right. Exhausted, I dragged myself forward, following a flight of stairs downward into the earth. The stairs led down into a vast chamber. I cast my light around the room, revealing a terrifying mural covering the entirety of one massive wall. The mural showed the figure standing proudly atop a mountain of corpses holding a massive axe with a single eye embedded in it. So, what that's the, the soul edge, but it's an Astaroth's axe, gotcha. Oh shit. Countless bizarre symbols were carved everywhere, each of them emanating the same dark energy that the skeletons above had. An altar loomed in the center of the chamber, surrounded by ancient vases. I tried lifting one and found it to be extremely heavy. I broke open the vase's seal to find it stuffed to the brim with jewels and gold. Holy shit. Yeah. So shit. many who had come seeking this vast fortune had paid for it with their lives. The old man who had made it out alive, but it was forever changed. I began to feel like a malevolent weight of this place pressed upon me. Thinking of the army of the dead and this disturbing mural, I now knew why the old man had said he just wanted to forget it all. So we did it. Yeah. Surges in your body. Yay, level 9. <laughs> Ooh. Impervious Heliodor. I don't know how what level this person's gonna be, but we're gonna find out. Shit. Well, capture the cinnamon thieves. Oh, that's gonna be easy. The minimum. Yeah. Ceylon is a ma is a major producer of cinnamon. A spice Kitty. favored by royalty and the upper classes. One of the uh, island's plantation owners came to me with a request. Also, you're a cutie. Shut up. You know, you're cute. No. There had been regular tests from a simonimimim farm. And the manager managed to stop them. Also, yes, that is exactly how I say it. Unless I'm just not paying attention, I can say it properly. But if you're I am cute. paying attention, I just cannot <laughs> say the word. You're cute. <laughs> just that I care, no? <laughs> like, that's why I keep fucking it up. Because I, I just, just cannot that say that word ever. wanted to. When I waited in hiding. Right once. <laughs> oh, I did. Yeah, it's when I'm not paying attention. I can say it properly. When I am paying attention, I just cannot. I waited in hiding near a storehouse for possessed of seven in him. After a while, a group of people arrived. I moved to stop them from entering, and the band of ruffians fell upon me. Oh shit! <clears throat> We're about to fell upon their skull with a sword. <laughs> Funny. Yep. <laughs> I like why I just go funny. Cause you're cute. Oh, they're level seven. Okay. No. <laughs> just yeah. I know, right? <laughs> ow! 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 Okay, you want to know what you do to rude people like that? Yep. Drag the fucking neck upon impact. <laughs> <laughs> that was a certified death by snow snow. Yep, yep. Trapped between her legs. Uh, <laughs> yep. <laughs> Giant axe. Doesn't know how to use it. <laughs> right. How did you block that? You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Like, Weird. actually dead. You kick your ass. Hey. Ow. Hell yeah. 
It's got a pretty ass set of, set of swords. There one more? Yes. I think there was. Oh shit. Yep. This is the last one. Oh, no. We're not playing discus. Fucking relax! Right? But by the way, because I bought the rest of the DLC, you know the fox masks that you were asking if we could put it on the side of her head? Yeah. Yeah, we got that now, if you want to add that. <gasps> Yay! I captured the thieves and took them to the manager. They were used from a neighboring, neighboring village. The manager was pleased with my service and provided me with a wealth of expensive spices. Hell yeah. Yeah. Minimum high quality. Now, let us. That's actually a good place to end this episode. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Take care and have a good one. Bye. Bye. Yeah.